Hi guys, recently I made a video about the longest street in Lviv called Horodotska and today I want to tell you about activities that you can do uh, right around this area. First of all, I want to tell you about private courtyard of Justim. Uh, Justim um, has cleaned up this courtyard himself and decorated it and now it's open for the tourists. Uh, some neighbors helped him, others were very skeptical so he had to Fight this negative attitude. Uh, it's a small cozy courtyard with many flowers and fountain. The most important interesting thing you can do as you visit this courtyard, you can sit down with your steam and have a cup of tea, which is what I did with my friend. Uh, and you can talk to him and learn about his life because he's very open and he's uh, pretty famous. Information about him is now uh, on the radio and uh, in other news articles. So you can, you can visit this courtyard. Also, what else? Um, right next to it, there's Alliance Francaise. As I told you earlier, they are becoming popular, and before COVID, especially, they had many activities. So, I did uh, painting classes there and also wine tasting. But now they have exhibition by Halina Kornieva. Uh, she has a name in restoring cultural objects. She's a professor at Ivan Franco University. She's been painting she, since she's little and she's been interested in different art activities. And her paintings are present in private collections in Italy, Czech Republic, Ireland, Ukraine uh, and other countries. And I like her art because it's simple and I like the combination of colors. By the way, the paintings of our art class will be exhibited there soon. And you can see this painting that I've done and I like it very much because it's simple and also because of its colors. And you can guess who is the author. You can guess his nationality. Do you think he is Italian, French, or maybe Ukrainian, or British, or maybe he's Russian? What do you think? Please write in the comments section. And do you like this painting? And how many hours do you, do, do you think I spent on writing it? Lastly, my friend and I went recently to a spa and I wanted to share this experience with you. Hi. My friend and I are going to a uh, spa, uh, yeah, in a hotel. We'll see how it goes. The spa is located uh, right next to N Church, but it's a little bit up Shevchenko Street, uh, 10 minutes walk in a hotel. And so 
um, yeah, you can see, actually, I was very skeptical, but I was, relax I was able to relax once the massage happened. This is, this is how you can, uh, the, the interesting fun activities you can do in Lviv among many others and I'm just sharing my activities and my, uh, my time with you that I spent with my friends. You are in this area, you watched this architecture, you walked around and you had your guided tour. What else I can offer to you is Alliance Francaise which is, I'm standing here on Ohiyanka Street and also nearby there's a private courtyard which uh, a man has renovated and is now open for tourists. Thank you for watching this video. Please like it and subscribe to my channel. Bye!